Today is Thursday, September 6, and here are three films that you may want to see. Rust and Bone is the new film from Jacques Odiar. He's the French filmmaker who made A Prophet, which was one of the big hits of uh, the festival world for the past couple of years. The new film is the story of a very tough guy who is a father, a young man um, who's living on the street with his son, and he meets a woman who works in an aquarium. She actually works with killer whales. The two of them develop a romance. A terrible tragedy happens. I will not spoil that for you. But the story is really all about their relationship as they come together. He gets into bare knuckle fighting for a living just to earn some money. She's having to recover from this terrible accident and the two of them fall in love. It's a beautiful romance. It's done with the grit and the, the toughness that you would expect from the man who made a prophet and it stars the great Marion Cotillard playing the female lead in the film and she's just terrific. Uh, she deserves to have an Oscar nomination for this film. Another film you may want to see today is called Ship of Theseus. This is a new film from Anand Gandhi, and it kicks off our City to City program. It opens the section. It's a film that is philosophical, and uh, it's got big ideas in it. It's three different stories knit together in the same way that you might have seen in, in Crash or in Babel, um, all taking place in and around the city of Mumbai, and all dealing with how we uh, identify as ourselves as human beings, how we create our identities, and, and what happens when, when things change in our lives that are monumental. Are we still the same people that we uh, set it, that we started out as? The idea of the ship of Theseus is a ship. This is from ancient Roman philosophy. Um, it's about a ship where every single piece gets changed over time, and at the end of it, is it still the same ship? And the director Anand Gandhi is asking that about his characters and also about the city of Mumbai. If you change everything in it, is it still the same Mumbai? It's a great film, great debut for uh, a new filmmaker from India in city to city. Taboo is a new film from Miguel Gomez, the, the Portuguese filmmaker, and this was at the Berlin Film Festival where it won the top prize. Beautiful film, and a film that uh, deals with Portuguese history, and its history in Africa in particular. They, of course, had some uh, colonial territories in Africa. This is a story that takes place partly in the present day and partly in the past, dealing with characters who are in between Portugal um, and Angola. Uh, and the really interesting thing about it is that it's in black and white, and a a lot of the film is silent. So if you saw The Artist last year and you saw what uh, that filmmaker was able to do with silent film language and the whole era of silent cinema, you want to see what Miguel Gomez does with it. I think it's actually a, a completely different take, a very interesting take, on bringing the language of silent movies back into the present. And it's also got a very strong political core, which I think makes it even more interesting. That's Taboo by Miguel Gomez.